we got this nice view of the city. It's so perfect. Oh, yeah. I'm Amanda McCoy. I see. I do a little bit of everything. Um, mostly bass guitar and guitar, singer, songwriter. But what I do here in Nashville is if someone needs a bass player or a guitar player, they call me up. We either do dates on the road live or we go into the studio and actually make history and put it down on tape. We are on 8th Avenue South. We're looking at Carter Vintage Guitars. My favorite, definitely my favorite music store in Nashville. I thought it'd be great to meet here today. I feel like a lot of muses are here. A lot of um, good songwriting vibes. It's, it's beautiful. A lot of history, a lot of Civil War history, oh, which yeah? is very important, yeah. I think the thing I like about music the most is the way you connect with it, the way it makes you feel. I mean, there's songs I remember listening to like my freshman year of college. And if I hear those songs now, I can almost feel the leaves crunching under my feet. I can smell fall because it's when I was really diving into those artists. So it takes you back to the moment where you heard that music. And that's a beautiful thing. I think that music is something that connects all of us. Music is, is one of the greatest gifts for that type of feeling. I mean, I think. I mean, the feeling when you create with other people, it is, it's like being a member of a team because you can't do it by yourself. And depending on who you have in that room, you know, it really affects the outcome of the song or the track. And you do, you become, it, they become your brothers and, sis, brothers and sisters in music. It's almost like going to church, being a traveling musician. You, know, you never know where you're going to end up and you'll be immersed in all this history. The muses will maybe give you a song or two from your experience that day. This is a beautiful thing. So this is Carter's Vintage. You have no idea where these pieces have been or whose hands they've been in or what songs they've played. I, I like to create and to paint and I, I'm working on this thing. I was actually telling Hal, Hal about it. What I want to do is create an experience for the audience so when they come to see me play a show live, they get this experience of visually seeing what they're hearing. And I don't know of anyone who has really captured that as far as a live, you know, live concert experience, maybe even painting on stage or just trying to put the artist in, into the middle of what I'm creating, whether it be music or art or, you know, poetry. I mean, lyrics are poetry, but I, I just want to kind of immerse the audience into all of that all at once and, and make it a non-superficial thing, you know?